looking for aquatic insects. But if you look carefully on the edge of the mud wallow, you might notice something else. Can anyone see anything? Vim, do you see something? Yes, this is a very cool log. Oh, well, that's a very nice log, Vim. Is there anything else, Vim? Nah. Oh, there's nothing. Do you see any? I don't see anything. Oh, no, what's that? It is Votomi, the young male leopard in Kanyeni's cub. Now, we were looking for lion and we found a leopard. Isn't that wonderful? Now, I know a lot of you haven't seen him properly before, so I'm sure there's some very excited people. Um, I'm going to move around to get a nice view of him because I don't even know his spot pattern yet. But so nice. Isn't that wonderful? I can't see any sign of mom at the moment, but he's just lounging by the water, you know. It is a December time, holiday time, and in the Southern Hemisphere, we like to be next to water uh, during our holiday season. So there, he is a very beautiful young male leopard. I'm just having a quick look around, seeing if I can see Nganyeni. Now we can actually see how much bigger he is if you, you take him in comparison to to Hosanna. I suppose we better tell other people about this, hey, Vim? Yeah, I suppose. I suppose it would be nice. Oh dear. I think I'm too far away for my northern channel to work, so... Oh, that was it. Look at that. Isn't he beautiful? So he's not too far away from where we had him yesterday morning. But it looks like mom's gone off hunting and he's decided to lounge by the pool. You can probably find that little bit of damp soil there is a little bit cooler than everywhere else. And he's very, very full. So they did finish eating an impala yesterday. Any station in the East Copy. That lovely, lovely tail of his. Now I'm gonna have to try to get a, a snap of his spot pattern. I'm gonna try to get a snap of his a spot pattern and. Uh, Just changing some settings on the camera. Now, what do you see there? I see four on the left, three on the right, possibly. Or is he a three three? I think he's a three four. Yeah, three four. But I'll show you what I'm talking about now. Oh, aren't you a good looking little man? So, we're at the junction of Hornbull's Nest and Pipeline Road, at the little pan here. And that's exactly where we are. I can't seem to get hold of anyone on my game drive radios, I'm too far. So I'm going to ask FC uh, to tell, Taylor to tell Mike and Ephraim uh, where this leopard is, because I know they were looking. Now, we've got his spot pattern now, so he's definitely a four three or a three four sorry so we always start on the right hand side so there we go one two three or one two three four three four hello mr vatomi oh, i'm definitely going to remember that one We're at the junction of Hornbull's Nest and Pipeline Road. Well, it seems like our gamble to come down to the Cheetah Plains area was definitely worth it. Um, after Karula and Hosanna and Shongile's tracks led us to the southern boundary, I uh, was really hoping we might find Nkanyeni or Vutomi this morning. Uh, one is better than none, so we're very, very happy. And he's probably not going to move too far from this area for the afternoon, so I think I might actually shoot down here this afternoon again. Now, young male leopards 
can be quite playful when left alone, especially at this age. It's one of the best age ages to spend time with the male leopard because they are so full of joy. At the moment, he's full of impala and, uh, and he's having a little rest.